A local soldier who made the ultimate sacrifice in the Korean War is finally laid to rest in his hometown. And a story you'll see only here on Local 12 News, James Pilcher brings us a final farewell delayed more than seven decades. Corporal Kenneth Ray Foreman was 19 years old when he was declared missing in action during the Battle of Chosin Reservoir in Korean War. 71 years to the day of that declaration, he was buried here in his hometown of Mount Oreb. The burial took place following an official ceremony at a local church and then a procession to the Mount Oreb Cemetery. Danny Bolander of Brown County is Foreman's nephew and oldest living relative. He was born three years after Foreman went missing. He says his grandparents and mother never gave up hope their son and brother would somehow return home. It's a great feeling to finally have closure. That was kind of always uh, an open spot for my grandparents and, and mother, wondering what happened to him. Corporal Kenneth Ray Foreman, service At the funeral service, Army Master Sergeant Justin Tumlinson presented Bollinger with numerous medals his uncle earned, capped with the Purple Heart. Foreman's remains were in one of 55 boxes of soldier remains North Korean leaders returned to the United States in 2018. But it took extensive DNA research to identify the corporal from Mount Oreb because there were no dental records. Bolander and his mother both provided DNA to the military in the last 20 years, material which eventually helped bring Foreman home. Following a procession from the church, including the Patriot Guard, Foreman was laid to rest in the Mount Oreb Cemetery and a family plot next to his parents with a send-off from veterans and active military. That's where uh, Kenneth Ray will be buried and uh, I hope we're doing what they wanted. I'm, I'm sure that's what they wanted and it, it'll finally bring closure for them. In Mount Oreb, James Pilcher, Local 12 News. Another soldier from Walnut Hills just lost just months after Corporal Foreman in Korea is also being laid to rest soon. Corporal Charles Lee will be buried in Arlington National Cemetery this spring.